Hi, this is Bradley Bush. Today we're going to find out how to find the slope of any line that is perpendicular to some line that we're given. So, for example, say we do this example here. It says find the slope of any line that is perpendicular to x plus 4y minus 8 equals 0. And by the way, if you hear a little baby noise in the background, that's my three-month-old Jude. Say hi, Jude. He happens to be sucking his thumb while smashing his face into a blanket. Awesome. So let's find the slope of the line that's perpendicular to the line in blue that we're given, x plus 4y minus 8 equals 0. And it might be hard to visualize this. So let's look. So this blue line right here that you can see is the line x plus 4y minus 8 equals 0. So this is the line we're looking at. And we want to find the slope of a line that's perpendicular to this blue line. Perpendicular means it's it crosses it at a 90 degree angle. So the purple line is just a made up line. And I can change my slope to be whatever I want. So we want this slope to cross at about a 90 degree angle. So let's see, if I had to make this a 90 degree angle, and I would say it gets closer, it's closer, it's closer. I don't know. What do you guys think? It kind of, that kind of looks perpendicular to me. Of course, it's kind of hard because they're ski wampus, but that kind of looks perpendicular. So if I look at the slope here, it says the slope is going to be four thirds. Hmm. Let's keep that in mind. Sorry, did I say four thirds? I meant 4.3. Let's keep that in mind. Let's see what we find out. All right. So let's remember, I'm going to write that down so I don't forget it. Um, maybe 4.3. So let's keep that in our heads. Anyway, we can find this algebraically. We don't have to just guess. I just showed you the picture because I want you to see what it looked like so you can envision. We're given the blue line and we want to find the slope of the purple line. That's what we're going for. So, um, let's solve for y. The first thing we want to do is, well, we've got to figure out what is the slope of the line that we're given. So we're given this line right here. We want to find out what the slope is because we know that the slope of a perpendicular line is going to be the negative reciprocal of the slope of the line that we're given. So let's find out what the slope is. So if we solve for y, um, we start out with x plus 4y minus 8 equals 0. Let's um, take the 8 over, and we'll also take the x over. And that leaves us with... 4y equals negative x plus 8. And I need a little more space here. Then we need to divide by 4 everywhere. So we get our answer. When we solve for y, we get y equals negative 1 fourth x plus 2. Whoa. You okay, buddy? That was just a little bit of um, emphasis on my answer there. Thanks, Jude. So this is the slope of the equation 
we're given right here, negative one fourth, negative one fourth. So if the slope of the equation we're given is negative one fourth, then the slope of the line that we want that's perpendicular has got to be the negative reciprocal. So we'll call that slope m prime. The negative reciprocal would be you flip it, so 1 fourth becomes 4 over 1, and you change the sign. It starts negative and becomes positive. So the answer to our question is any line perpendicular to x plus 4y minus 8 equals 0 will have the slope of 4. And that's about what we guessed, right? Up at the top, we said we thought maybe it was, was 4.3. So let's go back, actually, and make it exactly 3. Or sorry, exactly 4. There we go. That's perfectly perpendicular. And we're done. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Um, if you like it, give me a like. And see you next time.